Harrison, thank you. You know, the big El Paso Fair happening is at uh, Escarate Park once again this weekend. Yeah, you might remember last weekend we reported that rides at that fair were malfunctioning just days after opening. So tonight, KFOX 14 News at 9's Julia Spencer spoke to the company in charge of those rides about the issues. Yeah, she joins us there with an update about whether those rides are up and running once again. Hi, Julia. That's right. I spoke with the director of the fair face to face who says most of the rides are ready to go except for one. This all comes after concerns from last week about rides that broke down during opening weekend. One ride that had a hydraulic uh, uh, component that failed it immediately stopped because it has great safety features. Um, and uh, it immediately was brought to a stop. Just this past weekend, we reported of rides that were malfunctioning due to mechanical or technical issues. This video was posted online via FitFam, showing the moments that a ride called the Orbiter broke down when people were still riding it. Although no serious injuries have been reported from these rides, the county is prepared to step in if need be. If there's reports of an accident and we find the accident is a result um, of you know anything the event organizer did or failed to do yeah we have the right to close it down we public safety comes first right you know that's what it's all about i did speak with the director of marketing for the fair today and he provided a statement that says the orbiter is awaiting a part needed for repair and once that repair is done, they will test the ride and perform safety checks. However, these issues still have some visitors concerned about who would step in if something were to go wrong. It makes me feel concerned. Concerned for the children's safety. I was actually not planning on riding any rides, just, just for out of safety. Or However, others were still determined to have a good time at the fair. I'm sure it's probably not every ride that's breaking down, but the ones that's having issues, maybe they should shut those rides down and fix everything. And if, I mean, if it's a ride, okay, and they inspect it and it's okay, I think it shouldn't be an issue. With almost all of the rides working and operating, the fair is still open for one more week until April 28th. To find out more information on how to buy tickets, you can head to our website at kfoxtv.com. I'm reporting live from Escalate Park, Julia Spencer, KFOX 14 at News at 9.